Good morning, everyone. Jill off Legolas is here, and welcome back to the Long Dark. Pick it up right about where I left off. I just slept the night. And what time is it? Just before dawn. I think I'm going to go back to Milton right about now, and uh, yeah. I'm probably going to cut out a lot of the walking here. Tongue feels like sandpaper. Oh, we're thirsty. Oh, yeah, wow. I think I made water, eh? Let's see. Um, maybe I should eat first. Let's eat the granola bar first, because I won't get any thirstier, right? In real life, you can. And the chocolate bar? And the beef jerky. And then we'll have wash it down with some water. No, first we we'll eat the sardines. That'll hydrate it a little bit. And now the water. It's a good idea if you're eating salty crackers to wait till you're fully dehydrated, because then that way you won't have to drink so much water, because I think 0.65 liters is all the water you could drink at once anyway, no matter what, so useful tip there. But anyway. One thing I might do just before we go. My fire. I'm gonna sh let me do something right quick. Where's my fire? Oh, it is right there. Okay, cool. Now, I'm going to show you a little something that you can do. As soon as I get this fire started. Roll a book. But you'll get the fire started now. Come on. I agree. Come on. That did it. Sure did. Put a chunk of cedar firewood on, and then I'm going to do this. Take a torch and extinguish it. The torch away. We'll take a color, a couple few torches, because they're kind of handy. I'll take about three torches. This does take a little bit out of the fire. Yeah, you know, I'm going to grab one more torch. And... Because these do wear out after a while. Take the torch, and now we're off. Well, this torch will basically give off light and make it a lot easier for me to find my way back home. I'm probably going to cut out somewhere around here because... Really and truly, this is pretty uninteresting to watch, I would think. Assuming I can find the way out of here. <laughs> is this the proper way out? Mm -hmm. I'm grab these roses. So why not? When we get up to the top, I'll show you another use of torches as well. Well, don't turn up the torch yet. A few rose hips. Because, well, rose hips are good for making antibiotic tea, and they're good, it's good if you run out of antibiotics. I'm noticing that my frame rate is much better now than it was. I think it's because I, um, I updated the graphics drivers. That's really helped a lot. Anything else down here that we need? I don't think so. Oh, there is. 
lamp fuel. I can use this. We sure can. Anything else down here that I missed? It's kind of dark when I searched last time. Did I check this backpack? No, I didn't. Holy smokes. This isn't good. Rifle cartridge. That's a bad thing to miss. Okay, is this everything? I hope so, because I'm probably not coming back here. Did I check this plastic container? Yeah, I did. Okay, good. I probably missed something, and you folks are going to rage at me in the comments for that, but... Oh well. So be it. Okay, here's the way out. Now, my footprints from yesterday survived all night. I guess there was not much snowfall. Anywho, I'm going to cut out here. And I'll meet you back up when I get out of this ravine. Alright, we're up at the um, crashed plane now. And I just climbed up the... Rose... Out of the uh, Rosehip Ravine, I'm going to call it. Or, well, the cave down there. And now it's... Time to head on up. What up oh, I think it's some reclaimed wood. Let's take it. Whoa! That wolf is awfully close. Ooh, these wolves are super close. Hmm. You know what we can use? These fellas. Another use of torches is to keep the wolves at bay. I think we just climbed this wing. Now, I'm probably going to get jumped as soon as I go over this ridge line. No? Or not. The wolf is still here, I would think. Yeah, wolves do not approach if you hold a torch in your hand. Whoa, he was here. Very recently. Oh, I can hear you. Oh, there you are. Come on. Bring it, dude. I got fire. He might be able to make him run. Let's try it. Never had much luck with this one. <laughs> he runs right past, you see. But tends to run the wrong direction. Now, we sprint. Leave the torch. Okay, here's another way to deal with a wolf. The wolf is afraid of the revolver shot, even if you don't hit him. And I kind of missed. But that wolf... ran. Looks like that wolf found himself something else to eat. No, he didn't. Okay, he's still running. <laughs> Oh, you nit! Wait, you're. I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot you again. I got more bullets. No, I'm just gonna outrun you. Do you charge? Do you charge? I'm going to. Oh, we found the rabbit. Yeah, you eat that rabbit. So what you can do? I'm gonna give this wolf a watch. Watch this. This is a little trick we can do.
Let's see, we shot the wolf. I need to find some place to escape this cold. I was gonna see if did I make him bleed? Okay, I don't know how I missed. That is kinda weird, but whatever. I missed. <laughs> we still ran. Okay, let's not mess with this wolf anymore. I'll just get out of here. <laughs> anyway, the rest of this trip should be pr pretty uneventful, so I'll probably cut out here again and meet you back at the house in Milton. Alright everyone, I am back, and as you can see from the sign, I am legitimately just admiring the um, scenic view. There's the bridge. There's the water tower, and there's our house right down there. I better make short work of getting there, because man, I am getting cold. And I'm going to have to go look for um, a better um, coat, because I don't think I have a coat, do I? No, I have no coat. It's a brilliant thing to have in the winter, no coat, isn't it? Yeah, we should be down in just a minute, and then we'll warm up. So I'm not too worried about getting hypothermia. Yeah, dude, you should. Yeah, dude, you should wear your gloves. For some reason, they don't show up on the character when you climb down. I don't really know why. I did sprint a bit, so I did get a little tired, but I can get rid of that using coffee, so I'm not too worried. Man, it's so much smoother here. Updating the graphics drivers really made a difference, didn't it? God damn, freezing. I know you're freezing. But look, you're practically home. People have literally died, though, actually. In blizzards. 100 feet from their door. That's how bad the visibility can be, especially in the Great Plains, where you have no landmark whatsoever. But where I live in Nova Scotia, you don't really get that, right? Alright, now we'll be... Homeward bound. A little bit of condition loss doesn't matter, because I can get it back fairly easily. I would like to find a coat at some point. I'm not sure where I'll find that. Okay, let's um, drop some stuff here, like this deer hide, which we can cure, and then we'll drop the guts. Because they need to be cured before I can craft with them. Where else? Where am I going to put the wood? Where did I put wood before? Food. Do I have a spot for wood? I think so. Yeah, this is my wood cabinet, okay. Because everyone puts wooden cabs, right? Let me, uh... Put away these matches. Because I don't need this many matches around here, do I? I'll carry the... That and anything else. Food, I don't have much food on me. Carrying, carrying a bunch of stuff. Oh, I know. I know what I was going to do while I'm warming up. Let me see if I have a firearm cleaning kit. If I have that, I can clean up this revolver, because if it's in bad shape, it can jam when you're trying to shoot it, and that's the last thing you want, is your revolver to jam when you're in a life-threatening situation. Ooh, I have one. I probably don't have a rifle cleaning kit. Do I have a rifle cleaning kit anywhere? I might. I have simple tools. I got revolver ammo. Well, I'll take that. And I'll put the rifle ammo away, because I'm not going to be using the rifle anytime soon. Okay. You don't need all these flares. Or the kerosene? You know, I'm going to fill my lantern. Hold on. 
I got a little bit of repair work to when I get home, but I think the first priority, though, is to find a coat. And because I would like to go to either Forlorn Muskeg, the Broken Railroad, or the Hust River Valley soon in the next few days. And without a coat, I am just going to freeze. There. I said it was down vest, but it's not even going to not very good. I'll probably take the rifle when I go for a long travel, too. Anywho, there's a few houses in this town that I haven't checked, so I'll just go check those quickly. And, yeah. <clears throat> Hopefully I find a coat. Even a ski jack or something would be fine. I know there's an expedition park if you go to Timberwolf Mountain, but we are by no means ready for that yet. That'll be a while. I'm gonna check all the houses down this street, but I checked some houses towards the farm that I didn't check, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's only minus 16 out. We shouldn't be freezing if we had decent clothes. Did I check this car? I did not. Hopefully they lock something good in the trunk, because what's the point of locking the trunk if there's nothing in it? Let's see my father who locks the trunk all the time. This must be my father's car. <laughs> or someone like him. I'm just afraid someone will take will open the trunk and steal and then something out of an empty trunk, which is doesn't make a lot of sense, but anyway. Alright. Check this car. Nothing in it. Oh, what about... I'm gonna check the house, too. What about this car? Empty as well. I'm getting ripped off here. This will come in handy. Yeah, if you match or not, a terrible thing. Let's go in and check the house. Is this a lootable house or is this house? Not lootable. I'm stuck. There we go. I'm stuck. That house is boarded up. I don't think you can loot that one. I think this one here is boarded up too. What? So is this one? Oh my goodness. There's only one house here left that I can loot in the whole Milton. Oh boy. The house on the hill there. I think I can check that too. I don't think I was there. But yeah, I'm a little ripped off when it comes to jackets though because usually you at least find a ski jacket. Or something. Something in the briefcase. Well, I didn't expect to find a coat in a briefcase. That'd be kind of interesting. Books. I got so many books. Let's ignore those for now. There's probably food in here, but I. I'll take I'll take food, but I really don't need food. A rifle cleaning kit would be nice. Or if it's without the firearm cleaning kit. Pots. I got. So many dang pots. I'll take one more pot, though. Excellent. I don't know. This guy must really like pop way more than I do. Because he says excellent every time he gets a pop. Okay, this oven can't be open. What the fridge? Nothing in the fridge. Salty crackers are pretty good for traveling because they're really light. They have a lot of calories in them. Sardines are good. Let's check the microwave. Anything in there? It says there's like beverages in there, but nope. Nothing. Alright, let's check upstairs. Doesn't seem like my quest for a jacket's very hopeful, though, is it? So far. This is a recycled can, which is... Well, that's just a prop. Fakey! 
think I can use this. No, oh, I don't need sweaters. I want a jacket. I make them. I know I can make one by shooting wolves, but I prefer to find one right now if I could over having to shoot a whole ton of wolves. But I will do that if I can't find find a jacket in Milton. I will shoot a wolf or two. What have we here? I think it's my old ton of time for that to cure, so it's not ideal, but I will shoot a wolf. Or four. If I need to make a jacket. What's this? Emergency stems are really good in a bad situation, but what's this? Wool socks are good for fixing stuff, yes. Alright, I guess we're only got a couple more, one more house left in Milton, is there? Okay, I think there's the house on the hill here that I'm going to check. I think that house up there is actually lootable. So... I think in the next episode I'm going to leave um, Mountain Town behind because we've seen pretty much all there is to see in this region as far as I can see. And I would like to show you some forging and stuff like that. We want to forge ahead and make some progress <laughs> in this series. So. Yeah, I think the next stop will be the Broken Railroad, because there might be a coat and a ski lodge there. The maintenance shed also has a lot of stuff in it, so both are good. Maybe there's even a coat in here that would be ideal, because I don't have to travel real long distances without one. Hope nobody needs one. this anymore. Mm, these mittens. Brilliant. Not exactly what I want, but whatever. It's a bed. I don't need really a new bed. Cardboard box. No, it's not very helpful. Can't walk on the bed, huh? Weird. Dog food, I'll take. Candy bar, I'll take. Wool socks are decent. Those are decent wool socks, huh? I did not see the tag first, though. This stuff will come in handy. No! Quality tools! That's what'll come in handy. Not the silly old, uh, what's it? Running shoes. They're pretty useless. Okay. I don't think there's any other houses left in Milton that I can loot. No, there isn't. I think I checked just about every location in Milton. You want to be careful running down hills like I did, because you can sprain an ankle that way fairly easily. Anywho. In all seriousness, I think... Though, it is time for us to leave Mountain Town behind. Yeah, sure, there might be something in the cars up, I don't know, on the road, but... Honestly, I think I've, we've seen pretty much every region of Mountain Town. A lot of what it has to offer, so... It's time for us to move on, explore the world, spread our wings! And what better thing time to do it than today? Yeah, I already checked that trunk. God. 
We just gotta go down the road past Paradise Meadows and we will go down Milton Basin and I think that will take us over to the Forlorn Muskeg. We don't get stopped by wolves. Man, it's so beautiful. Too bad I'm a little tired. What's this? The wolf. Wolves can't enter Mountain Town at times. That's a rabbit. <laughs> That's pretty funny. I mistook a wolf, a rabbit for a wolf. Anywho, so I'm gonna get organized and yeah, I'll see you in the next episode when we'll probably end up heading for the Broken Railroad. We'll make tracks for the Broken Railroad. How about that? Anyhow. Take care. Have a good day.